Hi there guys, Jojo Pet here, and today I'm doing another Feed the Beast in Minecraft with z Hi you! Ah, she sneezed at me. Yuck. Okay. Alright. Okay. Alright, so I'm back in my little hut, and I've made a lot of changes today. First of all, I built this trap door right here, and it leads into lava, and I just died, because, well, I left it open on the way out, like this. And I started walking, I was like, oh man, how do we get over this? And I tried to fly in, I couldn't do it. And, oh, now now it wants to stay open. I mean, you can open one of them, but not both of them. Okay. So anyways, uh, I started to walk, I had it like this. That's what happened. The first one stays up fine, but when you try to flip the second one, it does that. Oh, wow. Anyways, I fell in and died, I lost my jetpack, and I'll have to make another one. So, I built another lever on the outside, that way I can control it if I lock myself out, basically. But, so that has changed. Also, I uh, made a lot of changes. I made a solar array, a low voltage solar array, so basically I can power all my stuff and it stores in a battery. Not a bad box, but a, I think it's called a M MFU. And uh, see right here. That's that, and it feeds into a, a battery box that charges, and then it feeds out into different devices through wires, and I've got it feeding into the extractor. So see right here, I upgraded this transformer upgrade because this is a low velocity or a low electricity or low charge or whatever, and it needs an upgrade. So I did an upgrade on it, and this I'm about to I'll show you what this is in a minute, but. Over here, electric furnace, so it's always got power. If you see up here, you go one more up, right click on that, see this power level? This stores up to 600,000 EU. So it's it's sitting there charging pretty steadily. Now, I'm not using anything right now, but it does pretty well. And I've got the pulverizer set up on it. So all my electrical devices I can use on this. And it just funnels to this gold wiring, and it's double plated so it doesn't like lose as much charge. So I did that today. <laughs> to make one of these uh, solar arrays, it takes eight regular solar panels, and then you have to play with this thing, and which is not cheap either. But you know, it's totally worth it because I have renewable energy. I don't have to worry about coal or anything like that at any given time. So I'm real happy about that. I got that done today, and. I did a alloy furnace, and if you stay tuned, I'll do a glitch video of how to have unlimited iron and, in turn, unlimited diamonds because of that. But also, I want to show you this thing. What I'm doing right now is part of factorization, and I'm going to go over here to the crafting table. Okay, so the obsidian goes in the corners, the diamond block in the middle, and then TNT northwest, south, and east. <laughs> So then you have a craft packet, so you take that out of there, and you go over to the craft pack packer, or whatever it's called. Craft packer? It's <laughs> that's exactly it. That's what you were saying, craft and packer. And then you sit there, and <laughs> craft packer, not craft packer. Uh-huh, sure. <laughs> and then you put this little diagram here, this plan, and left, and ready, one, two, three. Oh, there it goes. <laughs> and it, it didn't make the sound effect. It oh, blew up okay. last time. I was like, I was shielding my ears. Okay, so now I have this diamond shard over here. Okay, so these diamond shards, they're used for uh, factorization, and it's the only thing they're used for. But if you put one here and one here, then you make a wrath igniter, and I'm going to show you what to do with that in a minute. All right, guys, so I'm going to show you what this wrath igniter does, and it's a lot like flint and steel, except like on crack, and it looks really cool with awesome effects. My favorite thing about it is that when you click on this right here, it only has like a certain amount of uses, but it will turn iron blocks into dark iron. And whoa, oh god! And it lights you on fire like that. Oh my god! Okay, so this fire will spread, and it'll probably scorch the earth over here. It's supposed to. I'm in a little island, so a Z bot doesn't kill me. <laughs> I'm not even like over there where you are right now, so I'm trusting that you're. Far, far away. I'm griefing, girl. <laughs> I'm griefing your whole world. I'm going to burn your house oh, to the ashes. We're going to fight. There we go. See that going? And it spreads. It does really well with uh, with trees if you want to make a forest fire. If y'all are into griefing. I mean, uh, not griefing. 
Mm-hmm. But it spreads really well and it spreads really fast. I like the effects. It's so cool. Hey, see, see the scorched earth? Well, it's really just like turns them into dirt blocks, the grass blocks, but still. But mm -hmm. it just lit, it just lit the the dirt on fire. Oh my gosh! Yes, it's so awesome. Oh yeah. Anybody have some marshmallows? Just make some s'mores, bro. Now mm. I'm just hungry. Mm, s'mores. It's like s one a.m. I can't be eating. S'mores shit. at three thirty in the morning. Yeah, girl. Okay, so I'm trying not to die. Let me go ahead and. Uh... All right. So you see that block that's all purple? That's a dark iron block, and that will break into dark iron ingots. Let me go back to my house real quick, and I will show you what that does. All right, so those eight blocks turned into 32 ingots. Okay, and silver on top and the bottom in the middle. And glass panes on the side. And then we're going to put this igniter back in the middle right here, and... Voila, we have a wrath lamp. This thing is awesome. Okay, so I'm gonna put that right there. Oop, there we go. Alright, so let's make it nighttime. Okay, and as you see right here, I put up the wrath lamp right here. This is what it looks like. That cool effect, like just like the igniter. And it lights up all this area. Just that one little lamp. So this is an awesome thing. Even if you don't use anything else in the factorization mod, this is the thing to make because this lamp is bad ass. It's a great light source and it make a nice decoration for your houses and whatnot. So anyways, guys, thanks for tuning in. Y'all have a good day and I'll talk to you later. Schizzle! <laughs>